This is IGCSE Biology and we're working today on the structure of the leaf. The leaf contains two layers that act just like your skin. One is known the upper epidermis and the bottom one is called the lower epidermis. Both of these layers have no chloroplast which makes them transparent. Right on top of the upper epidermis there is a waxy cuticle which is responsible to reduce the loss of water from the leaf. The palisin mesophyll contains the largest number of chloroplasts and this is where most photosynthesis happens. Spongy basophil contains air spaces and those air spaces allow gases like carbon dioxide to move into the leaf. Stomata are usually found on the lower side of the leaf. They're like your nostrils. They allow gases to move in and out of the leaf. Stomata open during the daytime to allow gases like carbon dioxide to move into the leaf close at night to prevent the loss of water. Lastly, leaves contain vascular bundles, which are made of two types of vessels, xylem to transport water and minerals and phloem to transport organic nutrients.